Dr. Long Vo. And who is Dr. Julie Dow? I believe they're with Smile Center Dental outside of Toronto in Burlington, Ontario. We did a terrific interview with both of them for our Dental Top Doc Legends program because of the innovative work in dentistry that these folks are doing up they there. They have some groundbreaking work. And you're about to see one of the questions and answers that we asked them during our interview series. And then at the end, we have a lot more for you, so you want to stay tuned all the way to the end. Special offer coming for you. A very special offer. Stay tuned. So a question from a new mom about your 2x4 early prevention dental health program. I breastfeed my baby. Can breast milk cause decay? Okay, so there, there has been some research done on that uh, that shows that breast milk is very unlikely to cause decay. Now the problem is because now some mothers uh, exclusively breastfeed their, their uh, child, they think that they don't need to brush their teeth because right. it's all natural and it's not supposed to cause decay and I, I, I've researched it and they, they show that it doesn't cause decay, therefore I don't need to brush my child's gums or my, my child's teeth, right? So that's where the misconception is because um, whether or not uh, breast milk can cause decay the truth is we will introduce uh, sugar from the exterior into our children's diet, especially when they're, they're starting uh, to eat solids. Uh, and uh, the, uh, it's all, always important uh, to remove the bacteria. And of course a lot of moms are breastfeeding longer and so they're going to have other things introduced besides the breast milk the yes. later they go in yes. that. So, yes. But by itself it doesn't cause... Probably not. And, um, okay. and even if it, it let's say uh, it doesn't it's still not um, practical because in real life uh, other bacteria will or sugars will enter the diet for sure There's and, and no you and your you wife uh, not only as parents but as professionals do recommend breastfeeding absolutely yes uh, that that is um, the healthiest uh, way for for your uh, your child right it's it's a the, the most natural food for them and so, Dr. Julie, I know that there's a lot of issues for a lot of people. This, this can really get a lot of uh, intensity going here, uh, mm -hmm. the whole issue of breastfeeding, <laughs> not breastfeeding. Anything else to add to that uh, that's important well, for us to know? Breastfeeding and not breastfeeding is a very personal choice. And, you know, I will never tell someone what they, you know, they should do. Um, but in, in terms of should, is breastfeeding causing decay, um, you know, we should think about cavities about you know what we do what we can do in terms of diet and oral hygiene mm -hmm. and that's what we can control the most so good oral hygiene practice is always the way to go um, so start early on keep those teeth clean and healthy um, you know provide with your child a balanced diet and healthy diet and if you do that then you have all the keys to keep their mouth healthy um, so it doesn't matter whether you're breastfeeding, you're not breastfeeding, your formula, um, or you're doing both or half-half. Um, it's all a matter of keeping good oral hygiene. So it's picking the path that works for yes. you and then really focusing on, on the health of yourself and the, and the child. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Whoa, Dr. Mark, that's a good answer there to that question. That was terrific, but that's just the beginning. We have so much more to give you here. Where do we have more to give you here? DentalSecrets101.com. DentalSecrets101.com. What do we have there? There we have, hey, we have the entire interview that this was just one question from, but that's just the beginning. We have the Dental Secrets 101 special report. Oh, you do want to get that. That's a Absolutely. downloadable right away. You can get all these questions and answers, some new ones, some other information. Lots of information to take care of your dental health and the dental health of your family. But you're also going to get an ongoing newsletter with great tips for your dental health and taking care of your kids. But the interview is going to be terrific because it is just lots and lots of information with two dentists. And every time we add another series of these, we add it to the same thing. So you may find there's a lot more there than you even think is there. So if you liked this question and answer, now's the time to get even more. So click on that link that's down below, Dental Secrets 101, and get all of this plus so much more.